My dad always had some really weird sayings growing up, which is kind of how, I think, how I got my sense of humor. My dad used to say shit like, uh, he would come out in the middle of the night, like, we'd be playing Monopoly too loud because I'm a rebel. <laughs> That's what I do. I, uh, so we play Monopoly too loud. My dad would come out in like, his underwear and he looks like Mario. <laughs> In fact, that's a tattoo of my dad. <laughs> a lot of people think that's Mario. I know that's my father. He really loves those overalls. He, uh... <laughs> Just let that one build for a second. <laughs> it's like an eighth of you know my dad. It's like... <laughs> You guys are like laughing extra hard. And the other guys are just pitching like a fat So I got everything I learned is how I learned how to lay pipe. <laughs> Ladies, I'm single. I, uh, my mom's great too. My mom, my dad's like a preacher and he's got all these great sayings. He used to kind of like bust out of the bedroom in the middle of the night and be like, you guys knock it off or I'm gonna bury you outside with your testicles hanging out so the dude can eat your testicles. I didn't even know that was part of the diet. <laughs> I watch a lot of Discovery Channel, too. Like, I, I check out Animal Planet. I didn't know that was, that was a thing they did. <laughs> My mom's pretty awesome. My mom is like a preacher's wife, like the definition. Like, if you look at a dictionary, like preacher's wife, you'll see a picture of my mom praying for me, because I'm a sinner. <laughs> and she worries all the time. Like, my mom worries. It's pretty bad when we lived in the same state, because, like, an ambulance would go by in the middle of the night, and she'd call me, and, like, out drinking, banging a whore. <laughs> She's like, I heard an ambulance, are you okay? I'm like, yeah, mom, I'm fine. Now that I live like two states away, there's like shit here on the news, but like there's a fire in Montana. She's like, are you okay? I heard there's a fire over there. It's like it's a big state, Mom. It's not a way to burn. I keep going back to the notebook because I wrote half these jokes last night. I procrastinate a lot. I'm not even kidding, that's the fucked up part about this. My whole family's pretty interesting, actually. Like, I have a really interesting background. Like, my grandfather was really interesting. Like, my grandfather, he just passed uh, earlier this year, actually. Can we get a round of applause for the Elder Evans? That probably makes him feel good. He was really disappointed in me in the morning. Sorry, we're interrupting this phone call. You paid seven dollars for this. Yeah. I left mine in the car. Was it important? No, I'm so Did a parent <laughs> die? Because <laughs> I would feel like an asshole if a parent died. <laughs> Is it a booty call? Because I don't want to interrupt. <laughs> wow, they should have cut off boobs a while ago too, huh? <laughs> Mad props to the bartenders for keeping that one going. I don't know her as a person, but someone, someone is lucky tonight. Oh, That's what you get for sitting in front of your boots and you